All right, guys, 2016 Historic Autographs, the Mob Premium Box Edition, MOB102, MOB102. All right, guys, let's go ahead and jump us over to our screen here. Mitch, you are up here at the very top. Don, you are down there at the bottom. Let's go ahead and get you guys pasted over in here. Uh, Vinny, I will check on that in just a moment. We had talked about nine. He may have said 10. I'll get it squared away. All right, guys. So here we go. Good luck. We got one. We got two, three, four, five, six, and seven. All right. So Mitch, you find yourself up at the top. VP down here at the very bottom. All right, guys, let's jump back over, find the letters that we will be assigned for the last names. All right, guys, good luck. We got seven. Here we go. We got one, two, three, four, five six and number seven all right so the letter s is up at the top the letter a down at the bottom let's go ahead and see which people wound up with which names here all right guys so there goes your last name letter there yeah i'll clear it up man in just a second when we get off here i'll 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 call Aaron real quick and find out what exactly AG said to everybody. So we're all on the same page. And then I'll run a banner across the top of the screen in regards to when it'll actually start. All right, guys, let's go ahead and jump back over to break screen here. I'm going to go ahead and get a screenshot here of everybody's assigned letters. <laughs> if a Peyton Manning comes out of the 2016 Historic Autographs Mob Edition, he's going to have some explaining to do. Yeah, auction tonight there, bud. Auction tonight. We'll figure out the time. All right, guys. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. All right, guys, so I'm going to try and pull the first one out here. Get a load of this. There's your PSA DNA down there. Frank Coletta, letter C. Joseph Reyes, this one will be coming out to you, sir. Nice shot there. All right, guys, next up, next up. We have a Henry Hill signed 11 by 17 Goodfellas poster letter h james w james w this one will be coming out to you henry hill signed 11 by 17 goodfellas poster wow wow this is awesome man that's great go ahead and get your frame ready man <laughs> go ahead and get your frame ready now, guys, we are actually, um, we talked to the guy that's in charge of this stuff, this product, and he is probably actually going to come on to the broadcast tomorrow while we're at the National. So um, I'm going to list up a couple more of these tonight so that we can sell those out, and we will uh, 
get those going tomorrow. All right, so that's the St. Valentine's Day Massacre. That's a 9.5 there. 9.5 there on the mob. Gang war rage between Chicago's north side, Irish gang, and south side. Italian gang, Al Capone, devised a plan to eliminate his rival gang's leader, Bugs Morin, on February 14, 1929. Two Italian gangsters dressed as police officers entered a warehouse owned by Morin. There were seven Irish members in the warehouse. All surrendered to the alleged police and lined up against the wall. The, quote, officers brought two men into the warehouse with machine guns. They proceeded to cut down the unarmed men. Warren, however, had made the officers on his way to the warehouse and never entered the property. So, good night. All right, guys, we'll random that one off in just a moment. That's the crime doesn't pay. And then we have another one here for Murders, Inc. Let's see if this one actually has... D for dead. <laughs> all right, guys. So this says Murder, Inc. was the enforcement arm of the commission. The assembly of all the crime family bosses. Murder, Inc. was first headed by Lepke Buckhalter. Um, and then Albert Anastasia members include Abe, quote, Kid Twist Relis. We saw his card in the last one. Bugsy Siegel. Harry Pittsburgh, Phil Strauss, and Joe Adonis. Each of these men had their own distinct style of murder. <laughs> so it was apparent within uh, who committed the crime. The task of the enforcement arm was to implement the commission's contract killings. It is estimated they carry out over 1,000 executions, several of them to their own people. Good night. All right, so I'm not sure who the three of these individuals are. It did not say on the card who the three of them were so we're going to go ahead and random off these two that is it out of that box there guys all right so this one came out first this one came out second so the number one spot yeah but i don't know if those are all three of the guys they had listed you know what i'm saying i mean there's a number of different individuals listed on the back end here <laughs> Mo, Larry, and Curly. All right, so here's what we're going to do, guys. We're going to go ahead and throw everybody back into a random. The top two people will get these two cards. The first person will receive the St. Valentine's Day Massacre. The second one will receive the Murders, Inc. One second here, folks, and we'll go ahead and random those spots off all right <laughs> you said the guy in the middle <laughs> looks like jp all right here we go guys seven times we got one we got two three four five six and number seven all right so don and james don and james don this one will be coming out to you there sir saint valentine's day massacre And then Murder, Inc. will be coming out to James W. Murder, Inc. coming out to James W. That is a nine on the mint there. All right, guys, that is going to do it for 2016 Historic Autographs, the Mob Premium Box ID on this one, MOB102.